הנה מה טוב ומה נעים שבת אחים גם יחד. How good, how delightful it is to live as brothers all together. It is like a fine oil on the head running down the beard, running down Aaron's beard onto the collar of his robes. It is like the dew of Hermon falling on the heights of Zion, for there Yahweh bestows his blessing, everlasting life. The Sikhat Hath is the most welcoming community to live in. like a swimming pool where you jump inside since you are not a good swimmer you get drunk so much so that you become crazy you forget about yourself you think only of others for their good for their well-being for the intention and in the process you are rewarded with so many gifts of love joy satisfaction contentment and above all, it is a life that is ruled by the love of God, that is who is above. The Sikhat Hath is the most welcoming community to live in. I feel so at home. I feel so happy. I feel so fulfilled. Amen.
Hi everyone, I'm Brother Daniel and I'm privileged to speak to you on this occasion. It's been two years or more that we have been together and I'm privileged to experience your love and joy in this community. You guys of second year are very nice and more than that, you are the best on this planet Earth and no one can replace your uniqueness and your speciality. You have a mighty heart that can accommodate everyone and more and your generosity and your love matters a lot. We are here because you are here and thank you so much for your love and concern. Carpe Dame sees the day. Keep pushing, never give up! Dear brothers of third years, you are blessed and you have really proved real brothers to us. Every one of us feel that. Brothers, the special quality that lies in each one of you is that of love. This is manifested in your life. And above all, you give each member of the community what they deserve. That is respect. I would like to repeat that word, respect. Thank you so much. So for me, community means we are knitted in love. Why do I say this? The yesterday brother of whom I met is not the brother of today because he has a lot of feelings towards each one. Sometimes he is in depression, sometimes he is in anger feeling, sometimes he is jovial. So it calls to live life as it comes but witnessing Christ. That's called a community life that I have experienced since three years in this beautiful community. of the community. Today we are happy to celebrate our community day. It is a day of joy, a day of happiness for us, and I wish every member of this community, including myself, a very happy community day. Just a message <coughs> for this community day. It is said that a community is not an addition of number, but a multiplication of love. And I believe that is true. A community is not built of individuals who come together, but it is of hearts that are joined together. So any community will be happy, any community will be uh, fruitful, it will be evangelizing if we really live in love, if we really share our uh, concern and love for, the, for each other. So my prayer and wish for this community is that we grow every day in love for one another. As we celebrate our community day, I would like to wish all of you my greetings to Father Rector, all the fathers and all the brothers on this very special occasion. We celebrate Community Day once a year. We are celebrating our community. But that celebration cannot be just once a year. Community Day comes once a year. But community is a daily event. We celebrate our community every day. How do we celebrate that? Well, two simple rules of Christian living. 
we live together as God's loving children in mutual love, sharing, forgiveness, and thus we build up our community. As I've said earlier, we have not come here as a community by choice or by chance. Instead, we have been brought together by the grace of God, by the will of God. And in living according to that will, we shall strengthen our community and we shall live our life as members of this community in joy and serenity. God bless you all on this Community Day 2015. You can see the monsoon has arrived here 2013 and it causes great havoc in the room of Brother Nasamis. You can see so many victims are lying, uh, lying around here. You can see mosquitoes, bed bugs, cockroaches, and so many victims are here. You can see all in these places are flooded here. So this is for NDTV reporting from Nasamis room. <laughs> I found a nice parable which I would like to share with you. The parable is this. I can be a community member like many things. For instance, am I like uh, the wheelbarrow that I have to keep on pushing every time in order to make it uh, reach the destination and it keeps on wobbling all the time. Or I can be uh, like a canoe. I have to keep on rowing all the time to keep it moving and keep it steady. Or I can be like a kite whose string I have to keep in my hand to keep it at the the right path. If it cuts off and goes, it will go and get entangled somewhere. Or I can be like a balloon, full of hot air, rises and very showy, but unexpectedly it can blow up. Or I can be like a trailer of a jeep that I keep on pushing all the time with all the effort that I need to do. And then, or I can be like the weather, can never predict what will happen tomorrow. Or I can be like the watch open-faced, solid gold and uh, pure gold, quietly busy going about doing the work at all seasons whether you watch them or not. They are full of good works and uh, they are like a rose whose perfume spreads everywhere um, even when you unsuspectingly they are there, their perfume pervades the whole community. Therefore my question is this, what kind of a person am I? Am I like what this or am I like a gold a watch? Tum se hi din hota hai Surmai sham aati hai Tum se hi It is by placing one brick after another that a mansion is built. And so, even the brick, sand, cement and other ingredients are important, a mansion cannot be built without the grouping hand of a mission. In the same way, it goes without saying that a community is a collection of heart under the leadership of an individual in cooperation with many others. The last 11 months of my stay over here has been a joyous, inspiring and a life-giving one. I have learned many things from our dear superiors. They have been a source of inspiration to me. As I found, they were loving, caring, prayerful, and at a time, corrective too. I have learned many things from them. The prophetic words of Don Bosco that closeness leads to affection and affection leads to confidence has been fulfilled in this very community. And our superiors were the one who inspired me each and every moment of my life. Dear superiors, I am grateful to you for being my superiors. One of the many things that I admire in you is that your friendship and collaboration with us. You are present with us not only in the classrooms and in the chapel for our prayers, but you are also with us in the playground, playing with us, watching TV with us and sharing the light moments with us, eating with us in our own table. This action of actions of yours really inspired me and I am grateful to you. Thank you, dear superiors.
भर घड़ी सांस आती है जिंदगी कहलाती है तुमसे ही तुमसे ही सो आई वेरी हैप्पी टू सेलिब्रेट दिस कम्युनिटी डे एंड व्हेन आई थिंक ऑफ द कम्युनिटी आई रिमेंबर वन ऑफ द ग्रेटेस्ट फिलोसोफर्स वोल्टेयर हु लिव्ड ड्यूरिंग द फ्रेंच रेवोल्यूशन ही सेड दैट people come together without knowing each other they lived together without loving each other and they die without even shedding tears for one another i think when i think of the community this water was very sure that those days because of the industrialization people were worried about money and so on and they were not able to build the community so community when we come together we try to know each other we try to love each other we have concern for each other and we grow we share our joys yes. and sorrows together so this is my message today as we celebrate our community that we feel happy in the community we feel accepted and we love one another so a very happy community day to each and every one of you I lived eight years as an aspirant in various communities before I became a solution. Besides the call of God, what attracted me and inspired me to become a solution was the family spirit, and love and fellowship in the community. What I would like to tell the community on this occasion of our community day is. Let's all love Mary, our mother, a lot more, as John Bosco taught us, because she will draw us closer to one another in love, in friendship, and above all, she will take good care of us, motherly care. As we all very well know, our non-teaching staff are integral and an indispensable part of our institution. Heart is raised with gratitude and admiration when I think about our committed. and dedicated not is teaching staff to be real the inner details that they see about the precision with which they carry out their responsibility sometimes questions my very self and above all their friendly disposition their ever ready feature in helping and also adjusting to any situation make the present squad characteristically efficient and service minded aankho mein aankhe teri baaho mein baahe teri mera na mujh mein kuch raha hua kya baaton mein baatein teri raatein saagate teri kyun tera sab ye ho gaya मैं कहीं भी जाता हूँ तुमसे ही मिल जाता हूँ तुमसे ही तुमसे ही फर्स्टिस वी आर रियली ब्लेस्ड टू हैव यू विथ सोल एंड वी आर रियली एंड शोर योर कंपनी लेट अस नॉट ओनली डूरिंग दिस कम्युनिटी मंथ ऑल थ्रू अवर लाइफ ट्राई टू बी अ ब्लेसिंग टू ईच अदर Thank you. Hello everybody. Wishing you all a very happy community day. For me, the community the task of the community is love. And what affects us most is our relationship with one another. Long live Sacred Heart. Na ko na hi hai tera
Say the wind, say the wind, say the wind, say the wind. 